Here's the funny thing, right? I've done a farming sim review before, uh, a long, long time ago, and I had the exact same problem then as I do now. I'm not a simulator fan. I never have been, and probably never will be. So this game isn't aimed at me. So it's I try and review it with a neutral head. And I've got to admit, it does the simulation things quite well. Albeit, the guy that you control has the emotion of a house brick, but you know, it's a simulation. As you can see, I'm not exactly that good at cutting trees either, but it shows you the diversity of what you can do. You can cut trees, you can bale hay, you can plow, you can sow, you can fertilize, you can raise animals, you can do everything that you would associate with farming. But the problem is, for me, it's aimed at a specific target audience. So it's hard to, to try and get that out of your system. But what I will say is though, the multiplayer is terrible. I tried accessing games, but any game that I wanted to access, I had to have the DLC. So the multiplayer is pretty much non-existent, but it's an absolute haven for anyone that really wants to get into farming sim because there's so much to do in it. It's just whether you've got the time or the inclination to do it. And there's nice little tunes that you can play right the way through to keep you occupied so you don't get bored, you know, very, very quickly. But it's, it's all right. It's mid-range, but I can't exactly slate it because it's not my type of thing. But if you're into farming sim and you've been in the ones in the past, go for it again. It's pretty good, honestly.